All right, here's another update on Project Swiss Cheese. I've been working on getting the uh, trim, interior trim, uh, off the car. Uh, one thing that was uh, a positive about this car is that all the exterior and interior trim was on the car. Uh, even the uh, Impala uh, symbols on the recorders on both sides. Uh, all of the exterior trim around the windows, interior trim, all there. Uh, I've got most of it off. Uh, you kind of see here, here's the... Uh, uh, rear window trim here down around the bottom. This was a uh, vinyl top car, so it's got this extra piece that go went around the vinyl top. Uh, we're planning to make this into a heart into a non-vinyl top car, so that we probably won't reuse. But there's the rest of the rear window exterior trim. Um, got mo got all the interior or most of the interior trim pieces off here. Uh, it does have chrome uh, trim all the way around the interior. You can see those uh, all along here, laying on top of the seats. I've got. Just one more piece to pop off there on the inside of the driver's side. Uh, and then here's the rear window interior trim. I've got it all loose um, and ready to come out. Uh, you can see some of the screws here. They're all Phillips head screws. Uh, all of them are these longer screws except for uh, the along the, the base of the uh, rear window here. It's taking that shorter screw that you can see right there. But all the rest of them are these longer screws uh, for all of the interior trim pieces. Uh, even around the front windshield, which I've got uh, them out as well at this point. So also got the uh, kick panels out. Uh, here you can see uh, on the passenger side that kick panel is out. And over here to the driver's side, that one is out also. Uh, so I'm get, I got the seat belts out here in the front. Uh, I still got the rear seat belts uh, to get out. Uh, I've been, I spent some time working on that one over there on the passenger side uh, by the uh, back door. Uh, I got it about halfway out, but it's uh, binding up, and so I'm letting it soak for a while. Uh, then I got two more on this side over here uh, to work on on these rear seat belts. Uh, but what's holding me up right now is this back door on the driver's side is uh, not wanting to come open. I've been able to use some various means of getting in there with a pry bar and prying uh, on the door mechanism from th down through the window and then uh, kicking on the doors and getting them to open. But this one here is uh, being a little stubborn, hadn't come open yet, so... That's going to be my next project to see if I can do what I need to do uh, to get that door open. So that's my update for today. Thanks.